Hey everyone, this is Catherine from Server Pro, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to install Optifine for Minecraft Java Edition. Before we get into how to install Optifine, here's a brief introduction of its features. Optifine is a greatly used Minecraft optimization mod. It allows Minecraft to run faster and look better with full support for HD textures and includes various configuration options. Optifine adds FPS boost and decreases lag issues to provide a smooth gameplay. It has support for HD textures and fonts as well as custom terrain, item textures, custom lighting, unlimited texture size, and more. Optifine is also mostly used to enable shaders and dynamic lights in Minecraft. It'll also adds variable render distance, allowing you to increase the render distance up to two times as far in Minecraft. Other visually enhancing features added by this mod would be better grass, better snow, clear water, and connected textures. Do keep in mind, however, that Optifine is a client-only mod, therefore if you join a server, only you and other players who have Optifine installed will be able to use its features. Now I'm going to walk you through step by step on how to download Optifine. Firstly, you need to open up the Minecraft launcher and you need to launch the version of Minecraft you want to use Optifine for. So in my case, I'm going to be using Optifine for the latest version of Minecraft being 1.16.3 currently. So of course, this will work for any version of Minecraft that you choose. So now that you have the Minecraft launcher open, make sure you select the correct version of Minecraft that you want to use Optifine for and then go ahead and click play. Now that you've launched the correct version of Minecraft, you can go ahead and quit the game. To begin installing Optifine, you can head on over to the link in the description or just type in optifine.net in your web browser. It's going to take you to this website over here. Now as you can see, we're on Optifine's homepage, so what you want to do is go over to the downloads section. Once you click downloads, it will lead you to the downloads page. Here you can find the download links to all versions of Optifine. Now you want to find the correct version of Minecraft you want to install Optifine for. So let's say you're downloading Optifine for 1.14.4. As you can see here under Minecraft 1.14.4 are all the download links for Optifine for that specific version of Minecraft. There are multiple downloads of Optifine for each version of Minecraft, but I would recommend downloading the latest version of Optifine, which is at the very top. Usually the old versions such as F2 and F3 could be buggy and laggy, hence going for the latest version is generally for the best. Before we move on to the rest of the video, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you never miss a new upload from Server Pro. Also, if you're enjoying this video so far, hit that like button. There are also preview versions of Optifine. If the version of Minecraft you're looking for is in displayed, such as Minecraft 1.15, you'll want to click on preview versions on the top of the page over here. It's going to give you all the preview versions of Optifine, but as stated, those are preview versions, so it won't give you the full version of Optifine, which means it may be a little buggy or unstable at the moment. In this case, I'm downloading Optifine from Minecraft 1.16.3, so I'm going to go over and click on the download button. Once you click on download, it'll lead you to a page which displays an ad. All you need to do is click on the skip button on the top over here. You can ignore everything else, you will have to wait for about 6 seconds for the skip button to show up. And now you want to go ahead and click on download Optifine on this link over here. You'll then notice that this file is being recognized as harmful. Don't worry, all you need to do is just click on keep. Some web browsers such as Google Chrome usually do this with any and almost all jar files. As long as you're downloading the mod from a secure and known website such as Optifine.net, you're pretty much good to go. And now Optifine is downloaded onto your computer. All you need to do next is go ahead and open the file. So there are two ways to do this. You can just double click and then open it with Java, or you can just right click the file, go to open with, and then click on Java. If both of those methods don't work, it probably means that you don't have Java installed. To install Java, just head on over to the link in the description or type in java.com in your web browser, which will lead you to a website where you can download it. Once you right click the Optifine file and open it with Java, this little window will then pop up. You'll now need to click on install. Then this little window will pop up saying Optifine is successfully installed. All you need to do is just click on OK. After doing this, Optifine is automatically installed into your Minecraft folder and Minecraft launcher. You can now go ahead and open up the Minecraft launcher. Make sure that you have Optifine selected on the bottom left and then you can go ahead and click on play. To make sure Optifine has been installed correctly, check the bottom left of your game screen if it says modded next to the Minecraft version you're playing on. This might not show for older versions of Optifine, so an alternative way to make sure it's installed would be to go over to options, video settings, 
and then if you see a shaders option available, it means Optifine has been successfully installed. Of course, shaders isn't the only new video settings option added. You can notice there are a lot of other newly added settings shown alongside it. If you wish, you can play around with the settings shown here to better suit your gameplay. And that's all you need to do in order to download and install Optifine for Minecraft Java Edition. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful and that you enjoyed it. Feel free to check out Server Pro using the link in the description down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe and leave a like, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.